Once upon a time, nestled in the quaint town of Willow Brook, there stood an old dilapidated mansion known as Greenwood Manor. Its towering structure loomed over the surrounding landscape, casting eerie shadows that danced in the moonlight. For years, rumors swirled about the mansion's dark past, but none dared to venture too close for fear of awakening the spirits that supposedly haunted its halls. However, despite the warnings, a young family by the name of the Carters decided to make Greenwood Manor their new home. Ignoring the warnings of the locals, they were drawn to the mansion's inexplicable charm and affordable price tag. Little did they know they were about to uncover a sinister secret hidden within its walls. As the Carters settled into their new home, their daughter, Emily, discovered a peculiar box tucked away in the attic. Curiosity peaked. She opened it to reveal a collection of old, tattered drawings. Each one depicted scenes of children playing, but there was something unsettling about them. The children's faces were twisted into expressions of fear and despair. Intrigued by the drawings, Emily showed them to her parents, concern etched across their faces as they recognized the mansion's former residence in the illustrations. The Greenwood children, who had mysteriously vanished decades ago, Determined to uncover the truth, the Carters delved into the mansion's history, uncovering a tale of tragedy and horror that would shake them to their core. According to local legend, the Greenwood children had been the victims of a malevolent force that dwelled within the mansion. It was said that their spirits still roamed the halls, trapped for eternity by the darkness that consumed them. As the Carters delved deeper into the mystery, they soon realized that the drawings held the key to unlocking the truth behind the Greenwood children's disappearance. Each drawing told a story, a story of innocence lost and souls trapped in a never-ending nightmare. As the Carters studied the drawings, they began to experience strange occurrences within the mansion. Whispers echoed through the halls and shadowy figures lurked in the darkness watching their every move. Desperate to break the curse that bound the Greenwood children, the Carters embarked on a perilous journey into the heart of darkness. Armed with nothing but their wits and courage, they navigated the labyrinthine corridors of Greenwood Manor, facing unspeakable horrors at every turn. But as they drew closer to the truth, they realized that the malevolent force that haunted the mansion was far more powerful than they could have ever imagined. It hungered for their souls, feeding off their fear and despair, determined to claim them as its own. As the final confrontation loomed, the Carters found themselves locked in a battle for survival against an ancient evil that threatened to consume them whole. With the fate of the Greenwood children hanging in the balance, they fought with every ounce of strength they had, refusing to give in to the darkness that threatened to engulf them. In the end, it was Emily who discovered the truth hidden within the drawings, the key to breaking the curse that bound the Greenwood children to Greenwood Manor. With a courage beyond her years, she confronted the malevolent force head-on, facing her deepest fears and emerging victorious. As the darkness lifted and the sun rose once more over Greenwood Manor, the spirits of the Greenwood children were finally set free, their souls finding peace at long last. And though the Carters would never forget the horrors they'd have faced within its walls, they knew that they had triumphed over evil, leaving behind a legacy of bravery and hope for generations to come. But as they bid farewell to Greenwood Manor and the town of Willowbrook, they couldn't shake the feeling that their journey was far from over. For in the whispers of the wind and the shadows that danced in the moonlight, they knew that the darkness would always linger, waiting to ensnare the unwary in its sinister embrace once more.